If you're a football-mad 11-year-old looking to meet your heroes, it helps if your garden overlooks your team's training ground. And Louis Fowler hasn't been shy about grabbing selfies with Liverpool stars. But on Saturday, things didn't quite go to plan after waiting for his favourite, Mo Salah. I saw his car drive out of the training grounds and then obviously he drove up here and that's when I started running and obviously I ran all the way up here. So you're running after the car? Yeah, the car was like in front of me and then I hit this lamppost here. With your head? Yeah, with my nose, him <laughs> actually, and then I, I bounced off it. But as unexpected as that lamppost was what happened next. Moments later, Mo Salah himself came to his house after seeing what had happened in his mirror to check on his fan. Louis managing to pose for a picture despite his broken nose. He asked if I was OK. He was really worried about me. It was a dream, like, you know, getting a picture with him. But you must have been in agony, weren't you? Yeah, that was in agony, but obviously when I met Mo Salah, it was crazy. It was like he healed me or something because I felt calmer. <laughs> But the real winner was Louis's brother getting his picture without paying through the nose. Louis will have to have his reset and admits he's learned his lesson. To never, ever look the other way when you're running. Even walking, you could walk into a lamppost. Or if you want a picture with your favourite footballer. Run into a lamppost. <laughs> yeah. On balance, Louis thinks it was a good result. His injury a price worth paying to meet a hero who lived up to the description. Ben Chapman, ITV News, Liverpool.